Hello Africa, welcome to a new one-on-one -on -one interview show focusing on Cameroon and Africa's movers and shakers. In an intimate setting, you get to discover the person behind a celebrity. My name is Sophia Aida and this is Focus On. Now in today's show, we have a man that has been labeled the number one rapper in Cameroon at the moment. From Douala to Libreville to Lagos, he has taken the African music world by storm. He has promoted Cameroonian urban music to the next level with his highly successful anthem, Ampere. The focus is on Stanley Eno. Stanley Eno by Yangi Boy, the voice of the youth. Tell us a little bit more about who is Stanley. <laughs> yeah, you know, uh, Stanley Eno. It's a young Cameroonian rapper, and uh, I do what I do, you know. And um, my real names are Ibai Eno Stanley, and uh, I'm a graduate of the University of Douala. You know, uh, I have a BSc in communication and all that. I'm just a rapper, that's me, <laughs> you know. Motherland, a brand with a message. What is the inspiration behind the name? Oh, Motherland, baby. No one of my mama. <laughs> you know, that is uh, Motherland. That's the name of my, my label. That's the brand behind it. It was high time we get back to the roots. To do it for us, by us, and all that, you know. So I wanted to reinvite the youth to get back to the basics back to the core, back to the bottom, because I have to start from the bottom to get there. <laughs> you know, so that's it. It's the berceau, that's how it goes, yeah. Rap music is sometimes considered as violent, and some recent events concerning you have been buzzing around the web. Is Stanley a bad guy? Mm. I, you know, I just want to thank you for this question, you know. Yeah, and, um, it's uh, it's kind of hard because I've I've lost like a couple of times, seeing all what is on the internet about my reaction way back in Bamina and the concert, you know. Yeah, it's um, it's uh, it's kind of sad, you know. But I just wanna I just wanna apologize to all the people I've hurt. Where my reaction, you know, my music is not about violence, you know. It's just that I I went to that show, the particular show, and um, I found out without prior information, neither to my team nor me, that the event was supposed to be sponsored by a beer brand, you know. Being that positive guy, the guy was a friend to the kids, I can't promote beer. My role is to make sure that, you know, the youth in Cameroon don't have a dream. That's my role, being that person who's gonna push them up to say, hey, Papa, réveille toi, get high, and do that stuff, you know? That's me, yeah. What's next for Stan Lee? Uh, next for me? <laughs> We're working on, uh, on the next single dropping, you know, Tumbu Tumbu Boss, Kalabasi Kabele Boss. Working on huge remixes, we're working on our new designs. There's a lot of things, baby. I hope they're ready for this one. <laughs> yeah. Thank you so much for watching. I'm Sophia Ida, and until next time, stay focused.